Mike Joseph back with preseason central here on the campus of Lafayette College on a beautiful day. Lafayette in full swing now with their football in full pads, and we have Will Eisler here. Will, great to have you here, and obviously a big year for you. It's your senior year. Absolutely. Uh, thanks for having me. I'm really excited to get going. It's crazy. We have the uh, the countdown clock in the locker room, and uh, I'm just uh, my mind is blown that we're 12 days away, but it's very exciting for us. Do you guys actually check out the countdown clock when you walk in there? Uh, definitely. I mean, it's right there when you walk yeah. in, right there up on the left. And Strategically by Coach G. Yes, exactly. <laughs> just keep that, keep your mind right, keep your mind um, focused on what matters, and that's just getting better, getting ready for that opening day. Well, you know, the Patriot League has done a great job recognizing great athletes and recognizing you, obviously, as an off a great player in this league offensively. Tell me a little bit about can we see some more – fullback h-back stuff because you know i get excited in the booth when i see a lead back or somebody that can catch the ball out of the backfield like yourself right i think uh i think you definitely can expect it i think we had some great moments last year in our uh two back personnel and sometimes even uh, a couple tight ends a couple backs um definitely helps us out in the run game but we can be versatile. We can use it in the pass game as well. Um, I think you can uh, expect to see a little bit of everything this year. Yeah, I know talking to Joe, Coach Garrett last year, he wanted to be very formational. He wanted to be able to put three tight ends, four tight ends, four wides, five wides on the field. And that's part of your offense, isn't it? Absolutely. And that's why it's so important that we get guys in their playbooks learning, learning their role in a bunch of different spots because that is part of the offense. It's a big offense. It's tough to learn, but that's kind of our advantage in, uh, in many situations. So uh, that kind of leads me into you as a senior helping out some of the young guys. Obviously, you got Selwyn back there. you got CJ. you got some guys that have played some downs, but they're still young. Right. That's true. And uh, they're still developing just like everybody else. And it, it does hurt having Wads leaving. He was a yeah. great natural leader for us. But we have a couple freshman tight ends coming in who are going to be helpful in the run and pass games. And obviously some explosive backs like CJ, Selwyn, Dunn. So that's very exciting. For nice me. to see them seeing their back run downfield right after you make a good block. Now, you had some exciting news the other day. Tell me a little bit about that. Was that a complete surprise? Because between you and Trent, that must have been something that just touched your heart. Unbelievable. And I'm talking about the fact that Will has earned a scholarship here his senior year here at Lafayette College for all the hard work he's done. Yeah, that was uh, an extremely special moment just being up there with Trent, a guy who I've been friends with since I came on campus. And it was a complete surprise. I didn't know what was going on. <laughs> when he got into the letter a little bit, I started maybe thinking about it. But I was in the running back room with Trent my freshman year. And he was getting in a little bit on special teams. I wasn't really touching the field at all. And I feel like we've we've grown together, it's just stuck with it. And uh, it's kind of amazing like seeing how far we've come and just uh, being up there with him to experience that. It kind of raises the level of what you want to accomplish this year. It's such it's fantastic. You deserve it and Trent deserves it as well. Thanks for spending a couple minutes. Absolutely. Thanks very much. Appreciate it. Mike Joseph, Preseason Central.